This program is brought to you by Emory University. First time I saw the double flush toilets, I was pretty confused as to I guess, the purpose of them. Um, but then later on, I guess we had a little instructional talk about how many gallons you save flushing up versus flushing down, and as to when you use flushing up versus flushing down. From what I'm told, the, um, the, the, there's a two flush system. Basically, you flush up for uh, number one, and uh, down flush for <laughs> number two. When you flush up, it uses less water than when you flush down, so that it's theoretically you were doing something that didn't require so much water. You could just flush up if you were, did something that really needed to be washed out, you can flush down. Blue water, I think for a few in Evans at least, the blue water comes from the gutter system we have here. It goes under underground um, and it accumulates into a, a cistern. Um, then we have solar panels that collect, uh, that collect sun energy and, and uh, use that to pump that and clean that water and back into our toilets. After a while and living here for a long time, I thought it was, I think it's really cool how like, you know, you flush up for if you're going number one, <laughs> you flush down if you're going number two. But like, um, it's it's really interesting because it really does make a difference about water usage. I never thought such a little change, it's such a little change. It's such a little change in my daily routine. It could have such a big impact. Such a big impact. It has such a big impact on the environment. The preceding program is copyrighted by Emory University.